most of the ideas that people have about awakening is from an unawakened mind. It, it doesn't understand what it is. So it thinks it's a thing. It thinks it's um, an object to be obtained. Yeah. It isn't. So I'm going to share with you now, to wrap this up, an introduction to your true nature. Mm. And some people this really resonates with. So let's see. So I'm going to pick up two random objects. I've got an, uh, an AC controller and I've got a phone. And I'm just going to ask you a question about each, then a third question, and just go with your first response. Mm -hmm. Right? Are you aware of this remote control? Yes. Are you aware of this phone? Yes. Are you aware? Yes. Right. Why did you say yes? It's, I don't know. It's quite apparent. It's like, do, right. I don't even have to it's answer It's quite that. apparent. It's yeah. quite apparent. Mm -hmm. So that, what you looked at, is your true nature. Mm. It's an instinctive knowing. You didn't have to look at an object. It's It just appears as a yes, as affirmative. Uh. That is the absolute. That's how close it is. So it's the only thing that exists that is not an object. So that is what I teach people to rely on, that knowing sense of awareness. And it's always with you. Is it there now? Of course, mm -hmm. it never leaves. So this mm -hmm. is the starting point. Wherever you are in your spiritual journey, whatever struggles you're having in your life, whatever confusion there is about this, that, and the other thing, wherever traumatic situation you're in, or wherever you are in the world, you can always turn to that which never changes, your own instinctive sense of awareness, and just rest with that for a few seconds. Mm and continue.